Anderson downhill. Anderson, Mr. Anderson, 30 yard touchdown. Very versatile player. And that one is blocked. Oklahoma got it. Touchdown Sooners. Marcella Sutton checks in at running back. Murray will throw it over the middle. And it's caught over the middle. This is Lee Morris still running. Look at Morris. Can he get a block at the 10? Stiff arm. Touchdown OU. 65 yards. Baker who? Second down at eight at the 46. Lefe Murray winds up down the field. Hollywood Brown inside the 20. James Pierre. Murray gives it to Sermon. Still on the move Sermon. Breaking tackles down the sideline, dives. Looks like a touchdown for Oklahoma again. Did you mention Joe Washington? Yes, I did. Okay, here's the option. In. Anderson getting downhill. Anderson, look at the burst. Look at that burst. Mr. Anderson down the sideline. Touchdown. OU 65 yards. I think his name's going to be on that list side to Rodney Anderson there wasn't even a defender there to pitch it but Murray was like hey 24 you take it you get the yardage and he does all of the yardage takes it to the house down that's when he really made his head second down Murray winds up deep down the field Holly. Whoa. touchdown 65 yards Could have been drafted higher based on his ability. Didn't have a good combine, is what they say. And look at this run. Sutton touchdown OU. 22 yards. That offensive line firing off the football. And it's that same play I've been talking about. Guard and tackle leading around and the Red River game. With this Oklahoma team underneath another completion as the receiver runs into the Official A.D. Miller. This is the best defensive play we've seen yet against Oklahoma. How about this? Oh, he tried to even said, "Do you see me?" He tried to get on. skinny. He tried, <laughs> he tried to get skinny. Oh, A.D. Miller is going to get roasted in film for getting tackled by the official. Oh man! You know what? I think that's targeting. <laughs> Throw him out. Throw him out of the game. Get him out of here. Look get at him that. out of here. Oh my goodness. I feel bad for A.D. Miller. He will never hear the end of that. Ever. <laughs> Here's the other running backs. They're like, no, no, he didn't. Oh, he got him. He got him. Bigger about that deal was all the races that the staff got here at OU. There's a ball thrown in the corner. Touchdown. A.D. Miller. I was, he got it. He got his touchdown. <laughs> yes, he did. <laughs> After running into one of the officials. Does it perfectly. First down and goal at the five. Singletary sprinting to the corner. And finally, Florida Atlantic on the board as Devin Singletary scores the five yard touchdown. Well, that was a good series there. So, this is a, a, a great rule change that they have made. And now Brooks. we're seeing the fruits. Another touchdown for Oklahoma, 41 yards. Kennedy Brooks. 62 to 7. Thirteenth straight home opener win for you guys, and at half you said it was impressive because it was impressive on all three sides. Take me through how that looked in your eyes. Yeah, it was fun to see. You know, we we got some big stops defensively there early in it, especially after we gave up the big penalty down there. So stop them. Offensively got moving, hit some big plays, and the pump block to me was the highlight of the day. It was just all three sides playing well, and and then good to get a bunch of guys in there in the second half and see some of those young guys play a bunch. There were always questions about what this team would look like with like without Baker Mayfield and I know we got to move on from that storyline but today who stood out how was Kyler Murray what other difference makers and leaders stood out to you 
Yeah, Kyler played well. Uh, you know, I thought we just played well as a group. You know, Lee Morris had a huge explosive play. Rodney Anderson, yeah. uh, some big plays defensively. Again, Lee Morris also the guy that blocked the punt. You know, so just just a lot of guys. You know, and that's what this team wants. It's may not be about this guy or that guy. We're just it's about the whole team, and they all rose up today. All right, Chip Kelly is back in the mix, and you guys will host UCLA next weekend. What do you expect from them? Oh, it'll be fun. You know, he's one of the best coaches to do it, you know, in our generation. Uh, always been a guy that, that I've kept up with personally, have a ton of respect for him. He'll do a great job at UCLA. We know it'll be a good challenge. All right. I hope we see a lot of you this year. Thank you. Sounds great. Thank Thanks. you.